All right, guys, I just got this cool new product in the mail that I'm going to review for you guys, but you've probably seen things like it before, so I'm going to explain why this one's better than the other ones. Um, I'll just have to dig it out of my flip belt here. You guys have all seen these before. It's just a basic little charger. You plug that end into a, a charger that plugs into the wall, and then you plug your USB phone charger into that end, and you charge your phone with it. This one also has a flashlight, and it's got a little spot here where you can put it on a lanyard, which is really cool. Um, so what makes this one special? Obviously the flashlight makes it special. That's cool. Uh, but it actually charges faster. I find that I get about 1% of battery on my iPhone 6 with the charger that I've got per minute. 1% per minute. Pretty good. Not as good as plugging it into the wall, but when it's portable, I mean, you got a wall to plug it into when you're out in the woods? I don't. Uh, I used to use a solar charger, but I find that the one that I've got anyways doesn't work very well. So what I do, I actually use my solar charger when I'm in a situation where I'm out, you know, out skating or I'm out camping or whatever. I'll hook my portable charger up to my solar charger, that way I can charge my phone throughout the night. Or if I'm on a road trip, I can keep those two portable chargers charged and I can play like hill climb racer for, for hours and hours on end because I can keep my phone continuously charged. Well, you're in a car, why don't you just plug it into the blah blah blah? Yeah, I can do that too, but see the thing is I have friends. <laughs> and they all want to have their phone plugged in too, so that doesn't always work. And, and I've got several of these things. I've got, let me see what I got here. I've got the iHome one. This one's, legitimately this is the crappiest one I own. It's a... Uh, 2200 mAh. And this other one, the Case Co, which is the one that I'm actually reviewing, is rated at 3100 mAh. And and it does, it makes it makes a, a noticeable difference. Uh, the only real thing I would change about it is that the flashlight is so weak, but it works for like finding your front door uh, to unlock it and stuff like that. Just, just real basic stuff. I wouldn't use it in a survival setting. I wouldn't take it camping as my main flashlight, but as a backup, it's really cool to have. Now I've also got this, uh, this one's by Power Rocks, the Super Magic Stick. I got this one when I got my phone, and it's rated a little bit lower than the Case Co. It's 2800 mAh. And it's definitely better than the purple one that I showed you a minute ago. I forgot who it's made by. Um, but the Case Co is definitely, definitely the better product. I'd like to see them do some new things with it, like the flashlight is new, for instance. But I don't think anybody's, I'm, I'm digging in my flip belt. I actually use this thing. I don't think anybody's considered putting a knife in one yet. Like, why not? Why not a knife or a can opener or a bottle opener or, or just make it like really, make it good for camping. That'd be really cool. Now, like I said, the Case Co, this is the best one I've got. This is the best portable charger that I've found so far. Um, I can't remember the price right off the top of my head, but it's available on their website, which you need to go check out anyways. Go look at these things, check them out. They're pretty cool. If you don't already have a portable charger, buy one, get the case coat. It really is better. Like, I'm not, I'm not just telling you that because they sent me one. It's legitimately a better product. So far, if anything happens, I'm, I'm gonna let you guys know. And I'm sure Case Co's aware of that because I'm a no bullshit kind of guy. Um, but it's, it's legitimately a better product. You will enjoy it. You will get your use out of it. And it's, it's something that you need to have in your backpack anyway. It's like, why don't you already have one? Like, you're slacking, man. Go out there and get one, check it out, and when you do, put it in your flip belt and thank me for finding all of these weird fucking products for you guys to check out.